what a way to end the year, especially one as eventful as 2RRFs has been. Only eight days after emerging from theatre, the 240 troops who were deployed to Op Telic received their Iraq medals, alongside colleagues who came home from Op Herrick a month ago. A time for loving and a time for hating. A time for war. A time for peace. They've had a week of reuniting and readjusting to both work and family life in Decalia, and it was particularly poignant to see one member of the battalion back in the ranks after a narrow escape in Afghanistan. And I have to say, you know, what you did, I think, is just an outstanding great Well done. Basically, I was giving aid to a colleague uh, in a, who'd already stood on a landmine when the chopper came in, and then another mine was set off, and then I stood on a landmine after that myself. And what did it do to you? Took my fourth, and then I've had the amputation above knee now. He's just got to stand up and get on with it. Admin clerk Amy Parry's used to being the only girl around. It's fine, you know, they're all like my older brothers, they all look after me, it's a big family, That's, so it's good. And she's earned herself a haul of silverware. Northern Ireland, first served in Northern Ireland for six months, um, and then I went to Iraq, and then I've got to two for Afghanistan. To get four medals in a year, it's just been an amazing privilege, it's just, you know. Exceptional, you know, it's just amazing. The mum, dad, uh, all the family uh, think I'm a hero already, you see, so it'd be good to go home. They're proud of me, quite proud. Yeah. Another hero, though he's taking a bit of flack for all the attention, is a veteran of the non stop battle in Nausad in Helmand province. With the SF machine gun, we was mostly um, putting indirect fire onto the enemy's target so we could either call in plane strikes or get the mortars to drop down on it. But if we got onto it quicker, then obviously we'd take on the Taliban. Because we was on the front side of the hill, we seen everything. We were the first ones to see it. We'd point out targets for the compound and stuff like that. The lads don't really agree with it because they was there as well. They'd done exactly the same as me. It's just that I got all the glory for it, really. I think the real um, thing that stands out for me, actually, is the, is the fellowship of the battalion. Last uh, Saturday, and you shared this with us, when, uh, when the boys came back and they were so pleased to see each other. Uh, mates from the same companies who by circumstance have been split into uh, to different operational theatres. What would you say to them as they go off on their Christmas break tomorrow? Thank you. Thank you for an absolutely splendid uh, year's work. I couldn't have asked any more of you. Thank you.